Well, the Georgetown City Council is considering annexing 17 areas throughout Williamson County. This map shows those proposed areas for you. Now, many of those are neighborhoods where residents uh, like the way th uh, things are right now. And tonight, they are planning to tell City Council members how they feel about the plan at a public hearing. And our Katina McHenry joins us live from outside Council Chambers in downtown Georgetown with more on what's expected there. Katina. Leslie, good evening. The City Council meeting began at 6 o'clock. It is a public hearing. Many of the residents here are living in the Logan Ranch Road area. There are about 80 houses in that area. They all signed a petition to stop this potential annexation. Like many homeowners, Warner Hahn unloads a truck full of mulch into his backyard, just trying to bring some life back. While most of Warner's backyard has lost life, he and his neighbors are hoping to keep alive the serenity of country life away from the city. The city imposes a lot of restrictions that we, we don't like. We don't like having street lights and, you know, we have our own well. We it's quiet, it's peaceful, and that's exactly the way he and his neighbors like it. Many of us like the wide open spaces, no street lights at night so we can see the stars. Harry Young lives down the street and doesn't want to be a part of the city either. A few neighbors have yard signs saying no to annexation. Logan Ranch residents believe because of the city's budget shortfall, it needs more tax revenue. Annexing all 17 areas could yield an extra $425,000 a year on last year's tax rate. The city says that's not the case. No, no, it really has nothing to do with the budget. Annexation is recommended for various reasons, emergency services, taxes, or even economic growth. But ultimately, city council has the power to make the final decision. So there's four potential meetings where the city council could pull any of those areas off the annexation list, and then it would be, and then it wouldn't happen. Now, city staff tonight is recommending to city council that Logan Ranch Road, including three other areas, not be annexed. Costing that could cost the city about $29 million in capital improvements, and they say it's just not worth it. But, of course, the city council has the final decision on what they plan to do. Tonight's meeting is the first of two public hearings. The second will be held on October 25th. We're live in Georgetown. Katina McHenry, KXAN News.